Isa alayhi salatu wasalam once saw the dunya embellished like a beautiful prostitute. And he asked her, he said, who are you? And she said, I am the dunya. And Isa alayhi salatu wasalam asked her, how many partners have you had? And she said, I've had billions of partners. Every person who's come to this dunya has been my partner. And he said, how many have you been faithful to? And she replied, not even one. And Isa alayhi salatu wasalam said, Fool is he who falls in love with you after he has seen what you have done to your previous partners. But the dunya deludes people. And this is why Imam Ghazali rahmatullah alayhi gives an example of a man who is walking down the jungle and he looks behind him and he sees a lion running after him and he runs and he comes to a well and he jumps into the well and whilst he's falling he manages to hold on to a rope. And he breathes a sigh of relief and, and then he looks beneath him and he sees this huge serpent with his mouth open waiting for him to fall. Above is the lion, beneath is the snake. The only support he has the rope. And then all of a sudden what he sees is two mice, a black mouse and a white mouse. And they set upon the rope. And they begin to nibble the rope. Above is the lion, beneath is the snake. And the only sport he has is the rope. And now that is being nibbled by mice. And in front of him he sees a honeycomb. And he sticks his finger into that honey. And then he places it upon his tongue. And momentarily, that sweetness of the honey makes him forget the lion, the snake, and even the two mice upon the rope. Imam Ghazali rahmatullah alayhi says, the, the lion is death, which is always behind man, always pursuing man. The snake is his grave, and to which every single person will fall. The rope is his life, and the white mouse is the day and the black mouse denotes the night and the rope which is his life the day and the night are always nibbling upon his life every moment which elapses really every moment which elapses will never return you can spend the dunya you can spend whatever you have to have that one moment come back. It will never come back. And this is why Imam Jawzi Rahmatullah says, To waste time is worse than death. Why? Because when you die, your connection with the dunya is broken. But when you waste time, your connection with Allah is wasted.